Good evening. Today I'm going to be doing a couple of more intermediate uh, log questions. They will be a little bit trickier, and that is a warning. So, um, okay, so let's start with uh, this first one here. I just want to simplify this, uh, this beauty. And, um, okay, I'm just going to start by rewriting log 10 base 3 as log 10 over log of 3. And uh, right away, I'm actually going to just um, combine these logs. And since I'm subtracting the logs, I can just divide the contents. 54 divided by 2 is 27. So log 54 minus log 2 is just log 27. Did I say 27 before? I hope so. OK. Um, so right now, we know that log 10 is equal to 1. So I can actually just rewrite this as log 27 over log 3. Because 1 over log 3 times log 27 will, get, will be just log 27 over log 3. And log 27 over log 3 can be rewritten as log... Oh, come on, this is not writing. Oops. Slow computer today. So log base 3 of 27. And uh, now we can even find a nice integer value. 3 to the power of what gives us 27? And that's just 3. So this whole thing here is just equivalent to 3. Hopefully that made sense. If not, please take a look at the previous videos. And number 2 here. Log a to the 5 plus log a squared over log a to the 4. One thing that I can do right away is combine the top logs because since I'm adding them, I'll be actually multiplying a to the 5 and a squared. a to the 5 times a squared is a to the 7. And at the bottom, I still have only log a to the power of 4. Now, because I have a log and an exponent, I can actually bring the exponent down and multiply by the log. So this can become 7 log of a all over. I can do the same thing on the bottom. 4 log of a. Log of a, log of a, they cancel out. The answer is just 7 over 4. That's it. OK, how about here? Um, just to get started, I'm actually going to transform each one of them as a fraction of logs. Log 8 base 5 will be log 8 over log 5. This guy here will be log 25 over log of 7. And this one here will be log 7 over log 8. Great. Now, because we're multiplying all these fractions, um, look at this. I can actually cancel out log 7 with the log 7, because log 7 over log 7 is 1. I can do the same thing with the log 8s. Log 8 cancels out with log 8, and we end up with log 25 over log 5. Then I can rewrite this as log base 5 of 25. And what is that going to be equivalent to? Well, we can ask just the question, um, 5 to the power of what gives us 25? And that is just 2. That's it. Hopefully that made sense to everyone. Uh, bear in mind that they are more intermediate slash almost advanced uh, log questions. Um, so if it didn't make sense, please take a look at the previous videos that may explain the log rules really well. Um, and um, yes, thank you for watching.